Rachel? So even though we've only been here a few short weeks, I feel like we've already met a lot of great role models. That's true, we really have. For example, in our department alone, we have Eric, who's the director of sales. Yeah, Eric's really shown us how to create a fun and enthusiastic environment and still have productive workplace. I've noticed that. And then there's my boss, uh, Sharon, the director of catering. Yeah, Sharon's really good at working with the customers in a professional way. They always have nice things to say about her, and she always interacts and communicates really well with them. Most definitely. And then I know you've worked closely with Stephanie, who's the director of conference planning. Yeah, Stephanie does a great job of being really personable, and she smiles and says hi and chats with everyone she sees, and it's really great hospitality. Right, I've noticed that she's developed a lot of great uh, personal relationships. Yeah. And then, of course, we can't forget Lindsay from HR. Yeah, Lindsay has really shown us how to dress professionally and act professionally as a young business professional. She does a really great job of communication through phones and email and everything. Wow, we really have met a lot of great hospitality leaders. We really have. I personally believe that the most important traits found in hospitality professionals is the ability to adapt to diverse areas diverse environments, diverse persons, diverse situations. It's just the ability to adapt to diversity. I believe that being a professional in the customer service industry, you need to be ready for any and everything that can be thrown your way, from an irate guest to um, a, a cultural diversity uh, problem going on, or uh, working with generations, or working with different diverse persons, working with diverse meetings, diverse groups. I think you need to be completely adaptable to diversity and adaptable to change within your field.